Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 57, 16, where we have 26 moves to collect three ingredients. So I see one here, and it looks like, well, I wouldn't say a straight forward shot, but a straight shot down here if we can get through these blockers of licorice and frosting and licorice locked frosting and, and popcorn and marmalade and a magic mixer. These look a little more intricate. They're wrapped up in these candy cane fences, but there are portal systems. So it looks like a, if I get rid of the waffles, then uh, eventually they'll fall down into an area. I have no idea where yet. I can't see. Oh, here. This portal system here. Now, the problem with these magic mixers is for every three turns that I take that I don't strike them, they can spew something out at me. The only benefit I see on this board is I've already got so much junk here, I'm not sure they could do much more to damage me, but we're about to find out. Oh, marmalade-wrapped <laughs> waffles. Well, I stand corrected. Thank you very much, but not really. Okay, so I just have to try to get through here as quickly as possible, and maybe try to make some specials along the way, but it's going to be tough to do. I've also got this waffle dispenser. For every turn that I take that I don't take out a waffle, new waffles can form. And then of course I still have these licorice locks and this popcorn, all of these things that require specials, and I'm having a hard time making them because of my limited field here. So I'm not really hopeful for this first playthrough, but I'm going to keep playing and I'm going to keep trying to learn what I might be able to do for future attempts. If I take out licorice on a turn, no new licorice forms, just like the popcorn. I'm sorry, just like the chocolate. I don't know why I said popcorn. I'm focused in here. Um, but just like the chocolate, sometimes it's nuanced on a particular level where you know, there's a one or a two turn delay. Okay, now what if I could get a blue through there? Mm, what if I could keep trying to get a blue through there? Nope. Uh, I have made almost no progress. That's the bad news. The good news is I probably can't do worse on my next attempt, right? Oh man, this is sad. Got a lot of stripes now here. I just can't use them and really use them in any good fashion. Let me go ahead and pause the recording. Meet you back here on the board. When I come back, I'm going to make this my focus. I'm going to try to use this area here to make stripes that can hit this. Because if I can strike this guy anywhere from three to six times, it's always based on the level, then he'll explode and he'll take some real estate with him, some of these bad things with him. So I'll meet you back here in just a bit. Okay, so, of course, in order to hit this, I've got to probably get that popcorn out of the way first. So let's make as many specials as we can in here. Clearing this area. Oh, wrapped candies. That's what I really need on this board, although I'd like it closer to the popcorn. I kind of had to use that one in order to clear the area out. So I've got some space here. Let's make some cascading. Oh, that's stripe. That's not a bad place to have that stripe. Okay, that's a bad place to have that, I think, in my opinion anyway. Yikes. How can I get this set up with a special? Yep, that's how. That's what I need on this board. Watch this. I know I don't have a lot of orange in a lot of great places, but this is significant enough to help me open the board. And as I get the board more open, I'll have the ability to make more matches and specials. Oh my. Well, I can make a stripe. I just can't set it off with this unless it runs around again. Oh, or I could do a stripe draft combo. That's what I'm going to do. Because it's going to hit that popcorn a couple times. And then... I can do this, and now I've got this combo. We've got things cordoned off by that candy cane fence, so we can't expect everything on this board, but we can get a lot done. And look at how many times this is being struck. If I strike this enough, it goes away. I could make a wrapped candy here. Kind of beautiful. I'm going to go for this instead. There we go. So there's one collected. 
And now I have to figure out the rest, so I need to get this out of the way, right? I'm gonna make a, a stripe here. There we go, we're dropping it through. Oh, this one's nerve wracking. Wait, where does it go? I'm gonna blow things up and try to find out. Why is that not shifting downward? Oh, is it the popcorn that's in the way? No, because it's not always in the way. All right, that's clear. Why is that one not moving? All right, so I still have some work to do on this. I'm gonna leave that as an example of how close we can get, but I'm also gonna to try to figure out why that just did not shift downward. I thought I'd made enough ruckus in here that it should have. So I'll pause the recording again and uh, be more thoughtful and concerned about the end game on the next run. All right, let's do this. Yeah, I don't have any moves I like now. And now I like that one even less. All right, so we're punching through. We're going to get there. Here we are, getting through the licorice. All right, so some of that licorice is gone now. And now I have an opportunity maybe to get a color bomb. And then what? I need to get more licorice out of the way. So I can put this with something of higher value now. Hmm. Well, let's punch through. Here's a rat candy. See if I can get the blue to work together. There we go. This is what I want. Okay. So we got a lot of wrapped candy exploding. It's not only clearing out the center, it's doing a little bit at least to clear out these waffle here. And then look at that. I can hit that. Every time I can hit that, I'm getting a little bit closer to having it explode. Now I have to really pay attention. Only six moves left. This is winnable, but it's not going to be an easy battle. I'm going to go for cascading. Actually, I'm going to go for this, which hopefully will lead to some cascading. There we go. Wrapped, wrapped combo. I like it. It's not quite brilliant enough to hit this, but it's going to hit that popcorn and a lot of the waffle and give the board a chance to make some cascades. Look, there we go. So that's pretty. All right, and now I can hit this directly. There we go, we're clearing out the waffle. Now as these come through, this is kind of the element I missed before. As these come through, we have to find a way to bring them down. I still need to bring that down. How do I get there from here? I think I blow this up. I think I rely on this crazy pattern here. There we go. I got it. Barely, but I got it. And I think probably this is what hung me up before without going back because it's hard for me to do while I'm in the middle of the recording. That's what I'm thinking. But it is really tough to get all of these elements put together at once. And honestly, this is the kind of level that gets me bored pretty quickly. So I have to tell myself to pay attention to each move. All told, that was my 15th playthrough for recording purposes. If this was helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing right around here. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thank you so much for watching.